Well, I started out flying like radio control planes and like building them and like just once I got the hang of that and flying like really fast radio control planes and doing that, people always ask me like, well, are you going to become a pilot? And I was like, eh, not really. I don't know. But then I like, looked into it and I, and I took a class at my high school about aviation. It was the first semester they ever had it and I loved it. I loved just learning about all the different things, all the different systems of the aircraft and they had a simulator in there. It was cool. So I was like, well, maybe I should just become a pilot because I love it so much. It's cool, yeah, it's like when we go on road trips, they'll see a plane in the sky and be like, man, it'd be so cool to fly that. And now I'm like, I am the one flying it. So yeah, it's cool to switch from looking at it and wanting to do it to actually doing it. I mean, it's kind of nerve wracking because I just finished like the exam and we went over that and I uh, knew most of the information and actually trying to think about like having like no instructor there and just me making all the decisions and I'm the one in control. Thinking about it coming in a, just a couple of days is like kind of, it's kind of nerve wracking, but at the same time, I feel like I've done enough preparation and stuff that I, I know what I'm doing. I feel like I could do it, but it's still nerve wracking, yeah. So if I were to give someone advice who's like looking into being a pilot, I would say definitely look at all the schools that are in your area because if you just settle on the first one you see and you don't like the instructor or it's too expensive or something like that, then you're gonna have a bad time doing it. It's just gonna give you an overall bad view of aviation in general, and you're just gonna kinda get discouraged. So definitely look thoroughly at every single every single flight school and every single instructor around, and, and definitely the type of plane and everything like that. And take everything into consideration, because when it's, once you're at a school, it's really hard to sort of squ switch schools, and it just, too much change can be kinda discouraging. So make sure you pick a school you love, and just wait and be like, oh, I'll do it next week, because next week you'll say the same thing. The first time I had a lesson here, because I, I had done the intro flight and I knew I, I loved it and everything, it just sort of the hesitation of me like, am I gonna be a good pilot? I would just say like, no one really cares. Just if you want to do it, then you'll, you'll do it, you know? So once you, and I did my first lesson and everything, and I absolutely loved it and it was awesome because I knew I could actually like fly a plane. I was too nervous to like get into it, but once I did that first lesson, it was, it was really cool. I went on a, sort of a hunt for different schools and we sort of looked at like John Wayne Airport. It's a really big airport, but they were so expensive. They were like almost $300 per flight. We kept looking around and we finally were like, well, let's go to Corona. And we found Flight Academy. It was great. We found like the, the prices, $100 for the plane and 50 for the instructor. So that was really great. I looked at all the other schools, of course they were really expensive and they were really nice, but when it came to like how nice they were, it was like, I knew I wouldn't like it very much because of how they were so like organized and like I had to do the ground school by this time and I had to do this. Here I found that it's like more laid back and it's more like, it's around your schedule sort of. My goal is probably airlines or like corporate flying and even I would love to do some 3D flying, like even if it's on the side or something, because I kind of grew up doing like acrobatic flying 3D flight through RC planes and stuff like that. So I'd love to kind of link back to that uh, along with, you know, making money through. So my name is Matthew Fury, I'm trying to get my PPL, private pilot's license through Flight Academy.